Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So about a month ago, I let you know that just like Microsoft Edge, Google Chrome is finally going to be getting a pinned downloads button. So if we just pop over to Edge quickly, Edge, as you may well know, gives you the option to pin the downloads button to the toolbar, which is not the case currently in the stable version of Google Chrome. So just a quick recap, the downloads button in the stable version only appears when you are downloading something. So when there's a download in progress. So if I just save this image quickly, you can see to the top right of my toolbar, and I save that, the button only appears when you are busy downloading something or there is a download in progress. And then if I go into my history and I clear that, we can see the download button has been removed. So that's just a quick recap regarding that. Now, when I posted previously, it was still very much in its infancy and was still a patch over on Chromium Garrett. And I have noticed today in Google Chrome Canary 135 that the Downloads button is now available in the Side Panel Toolbar Options. And I think this is a nice move. So if we head to our Customize Chrome and we click on Toolbar, you'll see that the button, which is off by default, Downloads is finally available. And this is a default feature now in Chrome Canary. It's not hidden behind an experimental flag. So if we pop that on, you can see now that there's the download button. It appears now all the time. You can pin it, not only when there's just a download. So if we click on that, we can see, as mentioned previously, it'll open up the actual downloads page and the download history when you click on the button. And if we just head quickly into my channel, so I can just save this image and we can see that if we download something, there we go. The same look and feel as what you get in the stable version. Just the only difference is, is that if I head into that download history and I click and exit out of that download, you can see that the button still remains and even though I've cleared the history, the button is still pinned to the toolbar. And I think this is a nice move. I don't see why this wouldn't make its way to stable. Um, I think this is a very handy option. And obviously, when that does make its way to the stable version, I'll post and let you guys know. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.